Like, I'm looking back on relationships, y'all, and I see that I was the problem. Why was I the problem, Sam? I was the problem because I, because I didn't see me accurately, because I didn't see myself well. I didn't see my value. I didn't see who I was. I, I, I didn't see those things. I think that I accepted things I shouldn't have for way too long. Okay. I thought in this video she's taking responsibility for her actions, but in the beginning she takes responsibility for her actions. Like she said, she claims she claims that okay, there are so many things I did while in the relationship which I wouldn't do if I'm given the chance to be in a relationship once again. But she is talking about me, 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 about herself. She doesn't really talk about the other party, the other person in the relationship. She doesn't really talk about her ex-husband, Tyrese Gibson. Whereas we've seen videos, tons of videos of Tyrese Gibson trying so hard where he, he claims that he had been trying so hard to fix his relationship. He was trying so hard to make things work for him and his wife, Samantha Lee, because he genuinely loved Samantha Lee. But, you know, as they say, some women, when they, they feel that the man loves them too much, way too much, they turn to not appreciate that and they try to manipulate these men because they feel that they've got a grip on that man so they can do whatever they want and they will get away with it. That's why you see her dragging Tyrese in court. Now, even though they've got a, a prenup, and Tyrese even said that even before she had to take him to court for two years, after she divorced, after they, they got separated, he was paying $25,000 per month to Samantha Lee, even without a court order. So is it because Tyree stopped the stopped paying this money? That's why she has to drag him to court because this is money that Tyree paid voluntarily. Like no one forced him. He didn't have a court order that you must pay this amount at this point in time. He paid it because he has a daughter with Samantha Lee and because he's got the money. But He's seen that Samantha Lee is making about $160,000 per month from her businesses and from her YouTube channel. So he's, he, he's, he, he was thinking that, okay, she's got enough money because she's, just, she's got just one kid. She doesn't really need so much money. But you know, if you started something, you have to do it. You have to go, take it to the end until the wheels fall off. That's why Samantha Lee is, is bent on drawing blood. She's not going to back down anytime soon. Let's continue.